we go through the overnight hours, the skies will remain relatively clear. A few clouds from time to time, and that's going to allow temperatures to drop off. Then the precipitation will slowly but surely start to move in on your Friday. Front half of the day is where we'll see the sunshine and the clouds come in pretty quickly. And we'll start to build the shower chances in for the afternoon. Notice up there in northern Pennsylvania from the Poconos up in the upstate New York. We're talking about snow for them. It'll just be plain old liquid around here, and a couple of those showers will last into early Saturday morning. The sunshine will reappear with clouds mixed in, and another cool day on tap there on Saturday before the rebound. It's the weekend. 34 degrees tonight, a few clouds, cold, some areas of frost. 31 in Parkton, 35 in Air Harbor, 36 in Essex, and 34 tonight in Chestertown. We do have those freeze warnings in place. Everybody that is shaded in purple, make sure to bring in that tender vegetation. Urbanized areas are not included in this, but eventually we will get a freeze downtown at some point. It'll take a couple more nights or a couple more weeks to go. Morning frost and sun, late day showers arrive. As we get towards your Friday, northwesterly breeze at 5 to 10. It will gust likely upwards of 20, 60 miles per hour, 60 degrees, excuse me, there at the Inner Harbor 59 in Annapolis and 57 in Stevensville. Yard work forecast looks pretty good. As we go the next couple of days ahead, Monday, though, we bring back the rain. Pollen count remains high, so allergy suffers beware. Your seven-day forecast looks like this. Temperatures are in the 50s through the weekend. We may add some flakes north and west on Saturday. Then by Sunday, we'll be on the lookout for rain late and more rain. Therefore, your Monday going into the middle of next week.